It's listed. It's quarterly, you're up. Well, thank you. Um, I'd like to congratulate you all about the prospects and the improved local industry. Did, did I really hear that Steve is losing manufacturing here? A portion of it. Great stuff. Um, I have a couple of questions which I don't know if you want to answer here. For, for suggestions, for the Bell Baxter Prospector, uh, I don't know whether it currently includes wetlands and streams, but it might be a good idea if it did. It does. It does. Also, this may sound a little odd, but natural gas pipelines, for example, the one that keeps the It does. Good, good. good. You're, you're way ahead of me. Mm -hmm. um, little blue field, is that the same as little blue stem? Is also known as little blue stem too. Even better, one of my favorite plants. And you even put the actual bids on the screen for everyone to see. Very good, very good. And 100% VSEB. I mean, I'm embarrassed. I'm almost saying nothing but compliments. <laughs> <laughs> Keep going. I do have a suggestion. Now, you may well say this isn't industry as you think of it, but it's something you could have an influence on. Internet access in this community, mm, what's the technical word? Mm, sucks. Now, uh, those of you who can get Mediacom, you can get, I think it's six megabits per second. Uh, in Chattanooga, you can get 100 megabits per second. In Thomasville, I think you can get 30 megabits per second. LaGrange, similar, Lafayette, Louisiana, Bowling Green, Kentucky, there's a number of places like that. And if you're trying to attract, you know, um, I'm all for manufacturing, but if you're also trying to attract what the Chamber calls knowledge-based uh, jobs and people to work in them, then they're going to want their internet access, not only at the company, but at home as well. And um, yeah, this is particularly brought to my mind, because since I was going through the videos of the previous meeting, <coughs> a, a certain alleged DSL provider in this area, their service kept going out over and over, and um, I, I'm far from the only one that has this experience. So what am I suggesting? If you could find a way to promote, A, those that actually provide internet service, make it a little more reliable. B, find a way to make it faster. And C, what a number of these communities, such as Thomasville, LaGrange, um, Chattanooga, Hamilton, uh, have done, is they have a municipal area of internet service. Now, I'm certainly not suggesting that you guys run that, but you could help find out how that might be possible. That's my suggestion. Thank you, Mr. Foreman. Any other members of our fine community?